Oh boy, it's coming down. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Keep pushing! <laughs> Keep pushing! Oh, oh. man, who gets everything? Oh, no! <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Come, Come on! on. Oh, it's a tight line! <laughs> You know what, I can't be saying that. Loose, loose, loose! A little mark to shark action. Oh, wow. You good. <laughs> good old inshore mangrove right there, buddy. Come on, dude! Oh, this is sick! This is so sick. There she goes! Woo! Woo Hell yeah, yeah, dude! Come on, Come on boy! Come on. Dude, how freaking cool, man. All right, fellas, you ready to do some fishing? Yeah, man. Yeah, man, we're going to head out, try to catch us some live baits, get some pilchards, see if we can get some snappers and snook. Then we're going to go try to get you on some big tarpon. All right, Th come on. That's right, that's right. What's up, guys? We're out here with Captain Brandon, MM90 Films. That's right. And we're going to slay them. Come on. Come on. Guys and guys, baby. Guys and guys. So yesterday it was fun. You know, we stayed in shore. It was a little windy. Uh, saved our mahi day for today, which was beautiful. Uh, we started our day off yesterday getting them live baits, man. Yeah. That was pretty cool, huh? Oh, yeah, dude. We were plucking them. What plucking are those called again? What pilchards. We... Pilchards, pilchards, and then we started catching them thread fins. Yeah, yeah. Got some nice thread fins, man. I mean, they were boiling. I mean, they were boiling. Dude, it was crazy. You just put it in the water, pulled up, put it in the water, yeah, pulled up. Stringers pull, yeah, stringers full, man. Yeah, stringers. We call that the Iron Chef. Really? Oh, yeah. I love that. Man. I love it, man. It was good stuff. Started to dry up a little bit yesterday. It was tough. It's been pretty consistent on the bait. <laughs> But you don't know till you go. Making bait. Snapper, maybe a snook. Great white. <laughs> what? Great white. I'm down. Right here. I brought the water saddle. I brought the water saddle for the white shark we're about to catch. <laughs> 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 that's, that's all I gotta say about that. <laughs> yeah, the tide's kind of high. Just try to get them feeding here. Oh, uh, not too aggressive, but give them a, a little pop. For it, big dog. Oh, right homie. Here. Are you going all the way up? Oh, just right here. Leave the bale open. No? Oh, you can shut it. Yeah, you can go leave it open. I don't think I, uh, Let's try to get it pretty close. Yeah, I don't think you got it close enough. <laughs> really? The closer the better, for sure. You know what? I'm just trying to be courteous and not catching in them. Catch right, me man. If you're hooking trees, you're trying to get it in the right spot. Catch me a, uh, a Key West mangrove tree. Oh, son, hello. <laughs> Wow. Rob Jabro. Damn girl, give me a minute. Just waking up. <laughs> That 
one hit home plate there. Morning. Here you go, it. son. A little something, something. A little something, something. That's a start. A mangrove snapper. You got him? We're not keeping that up. No, we'll let him go. We'll get some bigger ones. <clears throat> oh, get you? No, I was trying to be nice with it. She smacked me. She smacked me. Mean <laughs> old girl, huh? A little better. See? Easy now. Let it go. Right. Kind of both have to share that corner for now. Hey, Brennan, you got them pliers, homie? Yeah, both up in. Yeah, hey, I need these fingers. I've been out the wrong oh. end of that too many times. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. I think he's slick. Whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. You guys want to keep some of these for dinner? These snappers. Very good. It's my wife's favorite fish to eat. They gotta be 10 inches, boys. He is about 12. Double fatty. Asking. Them suckers will hurt you, boy. Fish in the boat. Good old inshore mangrove right there, buddy. You got him? It's a great one. Good one for dinner right there. Kiss it. Nice. Get the belt. Nice one. Nice one. That's what I'm talking about. Poop fixing all over the place. Oh yeah. He almost had you in there, huh? Almost. Dinner bell was ringing. Nice one there. Fatty. Oh yeah, a little Kubera snapper. That's right. These snips here. There's not much difference other than these white stripes that come down here, and their teeth are a hell of a lot gnarlier. Look at those things. Put your finger in there. Yeah, we're right, dude. <laughs> <laughs> That's about as close as I want to be. <laughs> hey, boys, what kind of fish is this? That is uh, That's a sea snapper that, right that's there. That's a sea snapper <laughs> with a side of salad. <laughs> Hell yeah, great catch, guys. Hell yeah. 
That's it. We're going to let this one go. These fish grow up to 100 pounds, man. Yeah. They get big. That one's like 80. <laughs> just, the, just in the start of his adventure out here. Jeff, fish on. Wow. Swing them in. in, 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 in. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> shit. Now that's a snapper. Home for the home plate. Yeah. Hell yeah. Get in here with me, big dog. Here, grab them kind of where. Okay, the best way to do it is plant your right hand just where I got them. And watch out for the tops. And this, this thing down here will get you good too. Is it? Yeah, there you go. All right, Bubba, we're going to anchor up here. We've got some uh, mahi carcasses we're going to throw in the water. Get these fish fired up, throw a few chunks in there, and see if we can get them biting, man. All right, let's try to get them on. Yeah, buddy. Come on. It's been pretty good, so. Yo, Brandon, what you got there, man? Just got some bloody fish carcasses, man. We're going to chum up the water, see what kind of crazy big tarpon we can catch. All right, come on. Come on. And when we're done chumming the waters, you know, we'll let this honey hole double for the swimming pool. That's right, buddy. I just don't want to, I don't want to jump in right now with uh, the friendly uh, hammerhead swimming next to the boat right now. <laughs> He's around. He looks uh, mighty hungry. I cannot believe we hooked that monster tarpon like that, That's man. A big one, He huh? bought it for like an hour and a half, and then we finally get it close to the boat, it kept running, kept running, come in close to the boat, kept running. And then, to even make the story better, that huge rainstorm came in <laughs> out of nowhere. We weathered the storm, and right after the rain was gone, we landed the fish. Yeah, man, right about the sunshine came out, a fish decided it was, it was crazy. time, you know? Yeah. Well, we try like five, six times to get the leader. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, that was a yeah, big absolutely. one, dude. You almost lost your hat. Almost, right? you see that catch? <laughs> yeah, <I did. laughs> He's got him on, dude. Now you you move, listen, lose this fish, you're going in. Let me move these buckets. Try not to just reel against that drag. You know what I'm saying? So lift, 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 and then and reel as you lower. Perfect. Yeah, when, exactly. Just like that. When you hear it going ticking, just stop reeling and lift. Yeah. Add the story, done. And now, Jeff, when you see him come out of the water, I want you to just point the rod straight at him like you're trying to spear him with it. All right, that'll give them some slack. You can, I would Keep them from you throwing that hook. Can in, you in the video. See him jump yet? Oh, yeah. Tarpon? Tarpon, tarpon caught me. Oh, all right. Come on. Filling up on bait. It was the beer, dude. It was the beer, the butt light got him. Let him a little beer. Just like that, fish on. Definitely getting there. <laughs> Woo! We're in it today, boys. I love it. Yeah. Rain or shine. Oh, boy, it's coming down. When it's time, it's time. <laughs> you won't forget this one, dude. <laughs> yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. <laughs> I 
catch that fish for me anyways with Jeff catching it it was so I don't care if I'm behind the reel or not but it was so cool that fish is like a it's almost like wouldn't you say like a like a staple of the key absolutely staple as a absolutely. sport fish I mean we were down in that Bass Pro in Isla Mirada and we've seen the big tarpon on the wall and it is it's just like almost like a signature of the keys it and is, to be able man. to do that man it I is. think that is so so cool it was epic dude you know people again come all over from all over the world to chase those things whether it's fly rod or live baiting them sure you know or just you know trying to catch their first one you know get it off the bucket list mm -hmm. knock that notch off their belt yeah but um what dude, was it, shocking to me is i couldn't believe how big that tarpon was in, compared to the ones you see off the docks or oh, whatever yeah. you know like that was crazy that was full I mean, grown you know huge that's, what it that's one of those migrators years. man you know a lot of these fish here at the docks they they don't migrate as much. Them ones out there, they're the big ones, you know, 100 pounds, 200 pounds yeah. sometimes, even bigger, you know? Wow. It's crazy, man. It's uh, it's addicting for sure. Absolutely. Why do you think I do it every day? <laughs> Heck yeah, man. Man, and it was so cool to end the day with the booze and cruise at the end in the sandbar. That was nice. Kept that big Cracked carbon. open some good old Bud Lights, baby. Yeah, the sunshine popped out, cracked some brewskis. It did, man. Out. We doubled our fishing hole or honey hole that's, for a swimming pool. That's right, Bubba. <laughs> I love it, dude. And then what was even crazier is how that water can go from decently deep to very shallow. I mean, we learned that the hard way. The, the guy next to us, we're sitting there swimming, and this guy comes cruising through with his boat, and I mean, he... He, he stopped real quick, he huh? That, so. Oh, yeah. It's, you know, you, it's, it's a lot of local knowledge down here. You can't just go running around anywhere and think you're going to be all right, because there is. There's a, there's flats everywhere up and down the Florida Keys. Some of them aren't marked as good, you know? It's crazy. I got to, I got to jump off the old crow's nest. That's tight. <laughs> Did me a backflip. Yeah. Had me a nice cold beer, yeah, hung so out with fun. the boys. And all the mangrove snapper, man. Those are so good. We got to go cook them up. Man. Absolutely. So good. Absolutely. Come on. Love it. It's good stuff, man. That's what we do it for, you know? And what was all, also what was really cool, man, is like how there's like two types of fishing. You got the deep sea fishing, but you also can get them the, like the backwater bay fishing, almost like Carolina style, where it's like yeah. you know really calm and get up in those mangroves and dude, it reminded me of red fishing in Carolina. It's nice, huh? It's nice to have that option when Absolutely. it's blowing like it was yesterday. You know, 15, yeah. 20 mile an hour. You don't want to go out there and get beat up. No. You know, if you can stay in, especially this time of year, got Absolutely. them tarping around. You got some snook around. Nice inshore snappers. They're dude. on their way migrating out. I think the biggest thing that was shocking to me is how good the mango snapper eats, you know? Most people would probably think, not even think about that, like where it's like... Some people, and, some people don't, some people hate on them, but you know, if, if you've never had it before, you wouldn't know. Yeah. But if you've had it before, you know. Yeah, man, it's it was, good stuff. I know, I've never had it, and uh, it was awesome, man. Really good. It is good it's, And my stuff. favorite, dude, is the black and they do right here locally, right from, right from the water, from water to table. I That's mean, it. they threw it up the same night. You flayed it up, boom. It was on as the, fresh on the as it gets, plate. right? Oh, man. Yeah, Doesn't so get good. any better than that, man. Well, once again, dude, I just want to thank you guys, uh, you know, for, for having us out. And this was 
definitely an experience of a lifetime. And Absolutely. We're we happy good. to have you. We had fun. We drank good. That's right. Just we another day good. on Guides and Tides. You know what's yeah. up, right? Hell yeah, dude. We did good. Drank good. Ate good. <laughs> good time. Listen to good music. And I love it, man. It's cool. Good stuff, man. Guys, if you ain't seen it yet, click the subscribe button. Drop a comment. Let us know where you're coming from. I came in from Nashville to be on these guys' show, and I'll tell you what. Drop a comment. Link up with them. These guys are badass. You don't want to not be part of this. Hit the subscribe button. Give them a follow. Book a fishing trip. And we'll see you all in the next one. That's right. We'll see you next time on Gods and Tides, baby.